to my kitchen. Sorry I haven't made a video in super long. I had a really shitty month last month, despite it being my birthday month. But yeah, I'm back and I'm dressed like Coachella. Everyone else is at Coachella, but I'm just in my kitchen at home because I don't go to Coachella. And I'm just about to make some matcha tea because I just woke up and it's late as fuck. It's like 2 p.m. I just had some apple cider vinegar water with honey to take all my supplements and today we're going to do a tutorial on how to make your own baked fries because I fucking love fries but I probably shouldn't hit up like McDonald's or Jack in the Box or Rallies or in and out for my fries fix because baking your own fries at home is healthier and it's actually pretty easy so let's do this. So here I have four organic rust potatoes that I've roughly scrubbed and taken the little sprouts off of because I left them sitting too long. And we're going to preheat the oven to 450 degrees. Start. Next I'm going to cut these up into my desired size and soak them in water for about 20 minutes to release some more of the starches to make for a crispier fry. janky ass baking tray and get some avocado oil to grease it and I just use a paper towel to spread it around then over here I have that same bowl that I dried really really well you want to make sure there's no water at all left on this bowl and our dried potatoes I'm going to pour them in here. Then I'm going to drizzle some avocado oil. Then we're going to put our seasonings. First I have smoked paprika. I just eyeball everything. This is ground cumin. A little bit of cayenne pepper for that kick. Lots of turmeric. Some chili powder. Garlic powder. Some black pepper. And some Malden salt. Then we're just going to toss that in the bowl really well so everything was covered and seasoned evenly. This is what it's going to look like when it's all evenly coated. And now we're just going to go ahead and spread the fries in the baking tray in one even layer. That's looking pretty good. By now the oven should be properly preheated and we're going to pop the tray in on the bottommost rack. 
because that also makes some crispy fries. And we're going to bake these for 35 to 40 minutes, just check them every now and again. And then we're going to open the oven door every, I don't know, every 15 minutes to avoid steaming. Okay, it's been 40 minutes. Oh my god, my face just fucking burnt. Okay, so I'm going to let those sit for a while, and in the meantime, I'm going to make chili fries, vegan chili fries. So I just have this can of chili from Trader Joe's, and it has, it has like fake meat in it, which I don't usually eat, but it's fucking Saturday, and I want chili fries, so. I'm going to heat this up in this, pan, in this pot right here. this on medium high for like five minutes. Then I'm gonna put some of the chili. I wouldn't say this is healthy for you, but it's definitely healthier than going to say Tommy's for their chili cheese, chili cheese fries. I don't know why I didn't just pour it on. And then I just cut up some fresh tomatoes to sprinkle on top to make it seem a little healthier. And there you have it, vegan chili fries with diced tomatoes on top. Usually I would make a vegan cheese, but I was too fucking lazy. Again, it's Saturday and I just want to eat.